Hi everyone, it's me, Tommy. This is my channel, Tommy Can Fix It, where I teach you and everyone else <clears throat> simple DIY projects around the house, how to fix things, how to you know, make things, uh, tool tutorials, just things like that to make life simple for you when doing DIY projects. So with that, let's start today's video. In this video, we're going to learn how to read a level. Now, what is a level? It is basically just a guidance tool that helps you to correct an imperfection in the stability or the level of a project, a board, a shelf, whatever it is that you're trying to fix, correct, whatever. Um, the simplest way to explain how to use it there's a liquid in a little cylinder and there are lines on it in several places on the level and there's a little air bubble in each of them <clears throat> the air bubble is designed to move as it is because it's lighter than liquid just like this air is lighter so the higher end of whatever it is is going to raise that end of the level and show you that it's not level the ideal goal is to keep the bubble between the two lines here and here. Same thing here. Here and here. <clears throat> That's how you know it's level. So what we're going to do today is we're just going to level check the levelness of a few things. There are, um, before we get too far into that, levels come in different sizes. This is a little nine inch level. We also have a big two foot level. It's rightfully marked all the way to the 24 inches which is two foot mark. Um, so levels just like this one, just like this one, do the exact same thing. See, the bubble. It is made to keep it simple for you so you don't always have to eyeball things or use your eyes to try to guess if things are going to sit right on a shelf or if your shelf is level because if it's not it could end up putting too much weight on the shelf and it could fall or too much weight on the or too much stress on the wall itself or the anchors or the screws in the walls um, if you haven't watched my previous video on wall anchors since I did mention them or screws that videos will be linked down below um, but we're just gonna check a couple things here see how level they are obviously most of the time a box is going to be level so what we're gonna do put our level on it and then we're gonna check it And right about here. Now it's level. That bubble is between the dots or between these two lines. That's how we know that's level. If we take something completely different, say hatchet, and we decide to see if the hatchet is level. 
Well, clearly it's not. If it was built flat like that, it would be. But one end is clearly thicker than the other. You can see that. But if you're not sure, you can always use a level. Um, levels are also used for checking to see if a wall has been hung properly or if the um, studs in the wall or the drywall itself is level. And by doing so, here's my makeshift wall again, which is in the last video. We take our level like so, and we get the correct side, and it should end up being, if it was made correctly, should end up being level, or level enough that your bubble is between the lines, like so. This one's not 100% because a board that I used is not cut perfect, but it could be, and it should be, if it's a wall in your home. So, with this level, we used this one which works standing up this way for long things going horizontally you use the one in the middle this other one here is at an angle we will not worry about that one in this video see it's on this one as well here um that's for when you're checking at least to make sure that something that you are building at an angle is at a level angle um, which we're probably not going to do much on this channel unless we get it deep into you know heavy carpentry work and things like that um, but basically just keep Your bubble between the lines. I know this is kind of a boring video, but as is most educational things. Um, but that's how we read a level, what the function is, and that is pretty simple there. Needs not any more explanation. Um, if you're new to my channel, subscribe, hit the thumbs up. Um, if you're already subscribed, hit that bell icon to get notified of new videos every time they're uploaded. Um, definitely like this if you like want more videos like this. Um, comment down below if you have any questions uh, any other comments or any other videos you would like to see please let me know um, have a very handy day and I'll catch you in the next video